in the field of signal processing signals can be classified into two main categories one is stationary and other is non stationary understanding the differences between these types of signals is essential in many applications of signal processing including communication system audio and image processing and data analysis a stationary signal is a signal whose statistical properties remain constant over time these properties include mean variance and autocorrelation among others in other words a stationary signal has a constant average and a fixed distribution which does not change over time examples of stationary signals include signals generated by random process such as a white noise or periodic signals like sine wave stationary signals often used in signal processing applications because they are relatively easy to analyze and manipulate on the other hand non stationary signal is a signal whose statistical properties change over time non stationary signals can be classified into two main types deterministic and stochastic deterministic signals are those whose property change predictably over time such as sine wave whose frequency changes slowly over time stochastic signal on the other hand are those whose property change randomly over time such as stock uh, stock prices of a company which is which are unpredictable which are uh, over the time so non stationary signals are more challenging to analyze and manipulate then stationary signals because of their statistical properties are not constant one approach to deal with these signals is to segment them into stationary segments which are then analyzed individually another approach is to use time frequency analysis technique such as short time fourier transform which can provide information about the uh, frequency content of a signal as it uh, changes over time there are many practical applications of stationary and non stationary signals in communication system for example stationary signals are often used to transmit information over the channel while non stationary signals can be used to transmit signals that are modulated over time in audio and image processing signals stationary signals are often used to remove noise or enhance certain features of a signal while non stationary signals can be used to identify specific features of a signal that change over the time in summary i can say non stationary signals are uh, important also stationary signals are important both are important in signal processing stationary signals have fixed properties they do not change over the time while non stationary signals have changing statistical property understanding the difference between these two types of signal is essential in many applications of signal processing and there are various techniques and approaches that can be used to analyze and these signals okay thank you thank you so much